Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel and in today's video I'm gonna create this makeup look which will be suitable for each and every Indian skin. So let's just quickly go ahead and get started but make sure you are subscribed to my channel if you haven't already. So yeah, I'm starting off with a facial oil from Good Vibes and applying it all over my skin and today I'm gonna skip moisturizer so this is gonna work instead of moisturizer. And I'm just making sure the oil is absorbed completely into my skin and not just sitting on the top of my skin. Then I'm using the Good Vibes Green Tea Toner and I'm just uh, spritzing it all over my face as a face mist. Then I'm using the Cocoon Insta Lift to Wrinkle Filler and this works wonders as a primer so today I'm gonna use it as a primer. Today I'm gonna use the L'Oreal Infallible 24 hour matte foundation and this is more of a full coverage foundation. I don't really prefer full coverage foundations on a day to day basis but when there is some occasion or some festive season going on I would like to prefer a foundation that has a very good coverage so this foundation has a very good coverage and I really like it. Then I used the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Concealer and this is in the shade Sand. So this is also a full coverage concealer and today I applied a little too much but don't worry I will tone it down and I used a concealer brush to blend everything in. Then I used the Makeup Revolution Luxury Banana Powder to set my under eyes and my T-zone where I tend to get oily more. I don't really like baking my face so what I do is I just place the powder wherever I would like to set and then dust it off with another fluffy brush. Then I'm using the same good vibes toner to set my face and to deal with the extra powders that I have on my face. Moving on to my brows I'm using the Miss Claire eyebrow kick and I'm taking the second shade and just filling in my brows nothing to ham. So if you are a beginner try to get your hands on a brow powder or a brow pencil they are like more beginner friendly than a pomade or the other brow products that are available in the market. Then I am taking the Nykaa I am Bold Kajal and this is hands down my all time favorite Kajal and I am just tight lining my eyes with it. I'm taking the flat angular brush and taking the same I am bold kajal and just uh, lining my upper lash line. Once that is done, I'm taking the W7 Color Me Buff Natural Nudes Eyeshadow Palette and I'm taking the black shade from this palette and I'm just smoking the kajal further and also I'm setting the kajal with the eyeshadow so that it doesn't move or doesn't budge throughout the day. Then with the help of this brush, I'm applying this shade all over my crease and on my eyelid and I just flicked the kajal and made a tiny little wing but unfortunately my camera stopped working so I couldn't film it and with the help of the same eyeshadow, I smudged my bottom lash line as well. Then I curled my lashes and applied tons of mascara as I don't like using false eyelashes. Then I used a brow gel to set my brows on place. used the profusion nine colors blush and bronze palette now this comes with six blushes two bronzers and one highlighter and the highlighter is apt for darker skin girls and this is so pigmented you just need a tiny little bit next to contour my face i used the nyx highlight and contour pro palette and i used the brush that came in the profusion blush and bronzer palette i find the brush is very good for contouring purpose Next I'm using the Flower Beauty Highlighting Palette and I'm mixing all of these three shades and uh, just highlighting my face. As my entire face was looking matte so I wanted my highlighter to pop and this highlighter is beautiful. Then I added a bindi and changed my earring. Moving on to the lips I'm using the Nykaa Demi Matte Lipstick in the shade On Flick. Then I added 
just take coke liquid lipstick i woke up like this on top So that's pretty much it. That is the finished look. I hope you guys like it and I hope you guys find this video helpful. If you find it helpful then definitely let me know and please do subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Please give this video a big thumbs up if you like it and that's it for today's video. I'll see you in my next video till then. Bye.